Well, Granger typically has its own balance sheet and capital, so it's very keen to uh, work in joint venture with partners. Uh, we would not invest in something we don't believe it, but uh, we can make our money work harder if we in co-invest and, uh, and bring other investors alongside us. Yeah, I think we have more and more interest from uh, investors overseas at the moment, institutions that want to take uh, an exposure to the uh, residential market in the UK. I think you have different type of opportunities also depending on the investor's uh, risk return profile. For more core long-term investors, certainly investing in a portfolio and typically for investors are focused on the London Southeast market. Uh, the market has been very strong and you can pick up uh, strong rental growth and if you have a long-term view, it's an attractive investment with uh, regular capital appreciations. Uh, for investors with a bit higher risk return profile, there are two opportunities in my view, well maybe three. The first one is that recently there's uh, um, uh, planning uh, changes that make it more easier to do some uh, office to residential conversion, which uh, offers opportunities. And uh, the uh, residential market in the region, outside London, uh, now the market has corrected and selectively you can pick up quite attractive high yield in the range of 8 to 8 to 10 percent yield so it can offer opportunities and finally and I kept it for the end because I think that's the most interesting uh, uh, opportunity is uh, the uh, building of uh, stock for the market rent sector and there are some large schemes going on. The, market, the government is also backing it by providing cheap uh, debt financing for the development stage and the long-term hold stage, and that offers really attractive opportunities. And hopefully it will help for the creation of a truly multifamily sector in, uh, in London.